Hello, my name is Kapil Sethi and I'm a urologist. I specialize in management of prostate problems. So men often come to see me if they're experiencing difficulties in passing urine or having to get up during the night to pee um, and having trouble when they're out and about in their daily lives. So as men get older, the prostate gland can enlarge. This is a condition which is called benign prostate hyperplasia or BPH for short. This is the prostate gland here. What can simply happen is that the plumbing can get blocked. Um, symptoms that give you that indication are things like having to get up at night to pee, having an urgency and always having to think about where a toilet is nearby. You can also notice that your stream gets weaker and that you're not emptying completely. So whilst it's not cancerous, it can cause a significant you know, lifestyle bother um, and really affect your quality of life and, and sleep disturbance. And really that's where a urologist can come in and talk to you about the options that are available. One of the most effective treatments for an enlarged prostate is to surgically have a HOLEP. That stands for Holmium Laser Enucleation of Prostate. So the way that's done is it's done as natural orifice keyhole surgery. It's minimally invasive through the urinary passage whereby all of the obstructing tissue is cleared away. Um, and that's done with a laser and it allows for urine to flow very freely um, through the pipe once more and restoring normal function. So the benefits of this surgery is that it's very effective for all prostate sizes. There's no upper limit as to where um, the prostate gland has to be. Um, we also have um, the ability to do this on blood thinners because you bleed very little. Now normally after prostate surgery, you have to stay in hospital for one or two nights with a catheter, but the catheter can be removed quicker by whole lap surgery. And that effectively we're looking for something which is safe and durable and whole lap can achieve both of those things compared to traditional surgeries. So many men um, are suitable for a whole lap surgery. So the patients that would we were looking forward to who would be suitable for a whole lap would be if you've got an enlarged prostate, if you're getting symptoms, if um, tablets or other medications that you're taking have not been effective or causing side effects. Uh, we can do this on blood thinners. Like I said, there's no upper limit for where we want to go. So whole lip surgery can take half an hour, it can take longer if your prostate size is much, much bigger. When we have surgery like this is we're looking for the prostate to be removed um, as much tissue as possible. So we take out a little bit more than we do with traditional surgery. And we're usually looking for some durability of at least 10 to 15 years. With HOLEP, we have definitely achieved that. And that's why it's considered one of the most effective treatments. So every, every patient is different. Not everyone will require surgery. Many men do well on just medications alone. But if you are experiencing symptoms, the important next step is to speak to your GP who can possibly refer you to a urologist for a discussion of all the options that are available. Um, HOLEP in particular is quite subspecialized. There's not that many centers that offer it. Here at St. Vincent's, we have invested in some state-of-the-art technology, which is shown to reduce operative time. And HOLEP, like, like anything else, it, it's not here to make you live longer, it's here to make you live better. And the feedback I get about HOLEP is that um, many men say that it, has, it is life-changing and they feel like themselves again. Because um, our goal is really just to ensure that we have um, a safe and effective treatment for all men possible. <laughs>